Hey guys, Sushi Stu back on here with another tutorial with a second emulator for your playbook. This one is the Hugo emulator. There you go, as you can see that one's working just fine. So I'm going to show you how to install this one as well. So start off, we're going to go into development mode on our playbook. If you don't know where that is, security, development mode on. Input a password or make one up for your first time. Um, once that's finished, you're going to connect your PC to USB into your playbook when they're connected you're going to input your password on the PC now once you have that connected if you've followed my other tutorials you may have DDPB installer already on your PC if not download it install it download the emulator and download the ROMs I'll have links for everything. And the next step, once you're connected to development mode, is to turn on DDPB installer. So I'm opening mine right now. I'll move the computer or the camera over there to the computer in just a second. And there it is. There's DDPB installer. All right. So first off, you're going to hit scan. Input your password and connect. Yours may not take as long as mine to connect, but I do have a slow computer. All right, now that we're connected, we want to go to add first. You're going to find the Hugo bar file that you downloaded. Select open. And there we have it in our list. If you've used DDPB installer, then you may have things in your list. If not, check mark and select install. And there we have our install screen. It's processing. When it's finished, it will say OK. And there we go. It says OK. We hit cancel. We hit exit. Now is where you want to load up your ROMs. We're going to go to the playbook root file, misc miscellaneous folder, just like in the other emulator, NES. Now we have a Hugo folder, and we're going to go into ROMs folder. If you don't have a ROMs folder, create it inside the miscellaneous folder. Inside the ROMs folder, we're going to create PCE, PC Engine folder. Inside that is where you can install your games. You install lots of games, but just remember the only one that will show up are game.zip files. They have to be zip files and they have to be named game.zip to show up in the emulator. So remember that. But you can have lots here. The one that you'll play is called game.zip right now. So in 
install some ROMs. There we go, that's done. We'll go back to the playbook. Okay, we're going to go to our emulator. There it is. And start it up. Remember, like in the last video, if it doesn't start the first time, restart your playbook, try again. If it crashes, tries to start and crashes, you may have the ROMs in the wrong folder. Go back to the video and double check. But there you go, you have Hugo or PC Engine or Turbo Graphics 16 emulator on your playbook. Thanks to Froggy Face from crackberry.com. Peace out guys. Thanks for watching.